What? I'm freezing. <laughs> Too early. For filming? Could be. We're going up Mono Pass today. This is Will, he's fixing things. And we'll be back. We're going up Mono Pass. We came from down there and we are not even near halfway. Get a shot of the peaks into the sun. Woo! Mount Morgan. The one I inappropriately identified as Mount Morgan, that's Bear Creek Spire. There's Will, there's Kevin. Kevin doesn't feel good, so we're not gonna make him talk. He's got a cold. And that's all for now. Still on our way uphill. Top of Will's head. <laughs> now we're going we'll be... up there, pretty much. Around that little bend, if you can see a bend, probably not. And that's gonna be on our right when we get up there. Pretty amazing stuff, man. And I don't, I don't think. As I pointed out to you about a thousand times yesterday, we're way up above where we were yesterday, but we've actually begun to turn into an area that we couldn't really see most of it from where we were yesterday. We kind of turned right up into the mountains there. I don't know what direction that is. Probably north. Um, and what you see when you get up here is little things like this, just beautiful little place called Ruby Lake that you really got to hike up to and burn a little lung tissue to appreciate. <laughs> um, how you feeling there, Will? I, I, uh, I feel great. I mean, I, I can feel the al altitude, but, you know. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm feeling it too, but it's, it's not. We're, we're striking a, a reasonable old man pace here, whereas Kevin is, there's Kevin, there he is, I think you can catch him in there. He's, yeah. he's about 57 switchbacks ahead of us, he's and he's trudging, and he feels like crap, but he's, he's soldiering, man. He's been um, on top. We will uh, see you soon. You may recall in yesterday's adventure that we had a mountain that said no up at the top. Well, there it is from a different angle. We're way, way, way on the right side of where we were yesterday. And we're making a little progress here, too. Got to get up over that. That big thing. <laughs> I think we're going to go up through there. And Kevin is, once again, way ahead of us. I believe when we clear that snowpack up there, we're going to be up into Mono Pass. We're kind of in it now, but we're getting there. Kevin's probably already waiting for us. Last time we were up here, this was all snow, all through here. Not so much this time. Look more like that over there. Any words of wisdom, Will, or otherwise? Well, you know, I don't know what we're at. <laughs> Seven. Uh, higher than that. Something like Up that. over 12. Uh, this is as high as I've uh, ever been legally. Um, if you, <laughs> yeah. You look back and then you make a left. That's where we've been. That's where we've come from. Uh, it's incredible. We just passed a guy that had, he, he had me good. in a couple years and basically yeah. saw some cougar tracks up here. So it's pretty cool. We got our eyes open. We're actually not really hoping to see a cougar. The tracks are more fun. Well, we want to make ourselves big, but only by eating. <laughs> exactly. We're up where the snow meets the sky, man. Look at this. Twelve thousand six hundred. And that's where we came from. It's a little windy. Tell, tell, tell us that again, Will. What am I looking at here? Right up there. You're looking at a cougar print. He's been, he's been walking right at the edge of the snow. Yep. How fresh it is and how fresh it is because we were up here it should have been frozen and there's kevin kirsch now, he hasn't look, been eaten that's good he ate the cougar maybe i wonder if he put it between two now slices look of at bread. my print i'm i'm 200 almost 190 200 and you can see what i do yep yep and look he does the same thing uh, he's he's fresh he's fresh speaking of fresh it's kevin kirsch again i'm telling you man he put the cougar between two slices of bread he made a cougar sandwich. He might not even, he, he might be moving quickly because the cougar's right up his butt. Could be. Uh, Kevin thinks he saw the cougar. Like, take the edge of this mountain down here. Like, you go to, like, see where the shade is. Yeah. Where the shade stops. Right in that opening. You move there. over, yeah. You see, like, an opening, like, right there. It's like a dark spot. Yeah. It looks like, there was something, like, and then there's a rock in front of it, and there's, like, a little dark spot right there. 
there. It looked like someone was lying on the rock. But I couldn't tell. I was sure. But when I looked up, it was gone. Wow. Looks like the moon up here. A little less when there's not snow everywhere. Yeah. Last time we were up, this was all snow. downhill here not very far out of the pass I probably have shown this scene about 75 times already but you really can't get enough of it and there's our path headed right down and, and I will tell you that paranoia is knowing there's a cougar back there <laughs> and it's really not very far because I'm pretty convinced Kevin saw it on the way down from Ono Pass Thinking no more cougar threat here. The mountain agrees. It says no. That joke never gets old. Well, maybe it does. Looking down at Ruby Lake here. Not sure why it's Ruby Lake. It looks more like Jade Lake. And if you see right there, you see the little little feeder stream kind of right up the hill. But that's ripping in the springtime. Then you come over here and see an old guy. Gonna get philosophical. Don't do it, man. I can't help it. Look around you, man. <laughs> I've had your feet a little bit, but so are the hills. The mountain says no. Don't be philosophical. 